I'm gonna have to tell like everyone I meet that I'm just holding it for my girlfriend, who doesn't exist. A week ago, to help with video production, I got a fanny pack. So I figured this is just the slippery slope. There's a very fine line between feminine purses and man bags, so whatever. I feel like I'm gonna leave it somewhere and lose all my shit. And I'm expecting that I might get locked out. I'm actually excited. I'll finally have a place to put my sunscreen. This is my color, for sure. But it's also a bright green purse. Oh, this one's more of a winter. I, what, what, what do you think would look good with me? This one would be a statement piece. Oh, maybe I should be different and just get this one. If you're gonna do something in life, you gotta go big. So I am gonna take the red purse. This seems the neutralist of the bunch, so I'm gonna be a wimp and go for this one, I think. I can never find anything in here. This is awesome. It feels like Hanukkah or something. I have my wallet. I got the giant iPhone. Miscellaneous gum wrapper. I'll bet I'm the only person doing this who the first thing they put in is a knife. Can I fit this in here? I, oh, I can. A week from now, I expect to have a full-on rain poncho in here. I actually think I might be able to handle this. So it's been like five minutes since I got the purse and I've already put my phone in my pocket twice. I actually got a lot of compliments on this. Chris one. is working the thank, purse. Thank you. You can't even tell it's a purse. The key to rocking a purse in public, you gotta rock the walk. That was highly disappointing. I don't think she, she either didn't notice my purse or it's just like, I don't care. This is not her first man purse, dude. Yeah, this is not her first time. Audrey, why did you laugh at me earlier today in class? So I am doing laundry. As soon as I get in here, there's this gorgeous girl in a bikini top and just being super nice and high and friendly and I immediately go to hide it. That's right, world. I'm riding a scooter with a fashionable handbag. Deal with it. When I was at home, my mom asked me specifically to not bring my purse with me because, um, you know, she was concerned that I was gonna be made fun of, you know, in Hollywood that most people really don't care. I think in other parts of the world, this experiment wouldn't even be able to happen because there would just be way too much ridicule that nobody would want to do it, you know? Let's unbag. My keys, my wallet, and my phone. This is such a great place to keep your receipts. Vicks VapoRub. I have three USB chargers. Uh, hello, a change of clothes. I can carry this around with me in case I need to change t-shirts. I've never carried hand lotion in my life. Some lipstick. I mean, chapstick, oh gosh. Guys don't have like a socially acceptable place to keep your condo. And a copy of 1988's Big with Tom Hanks. And if you're like me, you'll get one that's actually a garden gnome with a pornographically long member. A week of wearing a purse was a little easier than I was hoping it to be. It helped me be organized in, in that I know where each of my essentials are. I think I got like a couple jolly smiles when I would be purchasing stuff. But I never fully lost the self-consciousness of having a purse on me. I don't think I'd ever do it like daily. After this, I'm actually considering switching over to a bag of this size. That is the benefit of the purse. All this, I get to carry around with me and I need all this stuff. I'm amazed at how strong the like gender bias is. How crazy of an idea is that if we just called it the bag that everyone gets to wear? If you wanna carry a purse, do it. If you wanna carry a man bag or a satchel, do that. It's great. Um, but please just let me use my pockets again. My girlfriend was like, oh my God, whose purse is that? And I was like, oh, I'm doing this for a BuzzFeed video and I explained what it is. And she's like, oh my God, thank God. I thought you got me a really tacky purse. And I was like, I picked this out. 